This is an isometric drawing of a small house, and this was drawn using the floor plan concept that we drew in a previous video. The purpose of this video is to show you how you can draw and represent a 3D view of your floor plan without using a computer, without using Revit. It's for concept presentation purposes. I placed some rough figures on the floor plan so that I could use them to draw the 3D to some kind of scale. I transferred those measurements onto the isometric drawing. If you're wondering what I mean by isometric drawing, it means that this 3D drawing was produced using a 30, 60, 90 triangle. The sharpest angle is 30 degrees, and it's obvious what the others are. As you can see here, all of the lines on the same plane are drawn at 30 degrees on one side, the wall and the windows. And the lines on the other side are drawn with the angle flipped, still at 30 degrees. The roof isn't scaled because of its incline, so it's drawn using predetermined measurements. You'll see how later in the video. So this is an isometric drawing, and if you were to draw the lines at 45 degrees instead of 30, then it becomes an axonometric drawing. Okay, back to the video. On the plan, as you can see, at the entrance of the building, we have to enter a porch. And you can see this porch on the front of the 3D drawing. You can see where the door and window placements are translated into 3D. I used real standard door scales, 900 by 2100 millimeters. I drew the windows by trying to keep it roughly in proportion with the door. It didn't have to be exact. The door was already exact in size, and this is just a concept. As mentioned before, the roof isn't drawn to scale. I tried to draw it at a pitch of roughly 30 degrees. In the Revit model that we're going to do later, the roof will be 30 degrees, give or take. Okay, now that I've explained to you how I drew this 3D view, I'll show you a time lapse of the process.
there it is. A 3D isometric drawing of the small house floor plan from the last video. In the next video, I'm going to color this in an architectural concept style using alcohol markers. If you liked the video, then don't forget to hit the like. And if you're interested in supporting this good work, we have an online store where you can buy the same mechanical pencil that you see in this video. The link to the pencil is in the description below. Thanks for watching.